Welcome back to Farmer's Dynasty. I've uh, been messing around a little bit. I did some lawn work with the weed eater that we have, the strimmer, if you will. Uh, went and cleaned up around the orchard. That orchard doesn't look very big until you go to mow it with a weed eater. Uh, made sure I touched up the edges around the buildings. I think it looks nice. You know, without all the weeds and stuff in the middle. I cleaned up out here a little bit. Around the fire pit. Looks pretty good. Uh, I hooked up the manure trailer to this tractor because today what I want to do is I want to do some experimenting now that we've harvested this and got the straw off it um, we have a plowed cultivated fertilizer and manure percentages I don't know what we do and do not need to do to be able to seed I've got the cultivator hooked up to that tractor and the manure hooked up to that tractor we only have two cows, so we don't have a ton of manure. But I want to see if it'll spread on the field as it is now. And then I want to see if we can cultivate without plowing. And, you know, just kind of do some experiments. And then I think we have that one last... Yeah, there's a cedar. So we may need to drive down there and do a quest to get that. But let's see how all this goes. Let's jump on a tractor. Oh, we're not hooked up. There we go. Bring this out onto the field and see what happens. So we can start fertilization. Let me, can I get this camera a little further away? Yeah, yeah, that's the ticket. All right. Z to start. Well, that doesn't really change. Oh, but it is counting as manure. I wonder if it doesn't necessarily have to be overlapped in every inch, if it's more a field-wide type manuring. I don't think I can see where we've driven yet. Oh, we're getting wiggly. is going down pretty quick but not quite as quick as I thought it would I've loaded all the manure that we have into this and it was not very full we may have to buy more cows simply to get more manure oh that's the other thing that I did was I um, went ahead and turned all the eggs and milk that I have into uh, condensed milk and canned eggs which actually was a lot easier than I thought it was going to be because it takes the same amount of time to make 20 eggs as it does to make one egg yeah so we're not going to get 100% coverage with manure on here but I wonder if that like adds to the yield a certain percentage I wish the game kind of laid out a little bit more the specifics of how it works like I get that we can spread manure and I get that that probably increases our yield but like we don't have any numbers and I don't know oh you need to be a hundred percent oh we're empty 100% covered in manure to get the yield bonus or anything like that, you know. Okay, so we ended up 41% covered with manure. Again, it didn't seem to change the texture, so I don't know that it really matters, like, the specific areas that we got or anything. I'm just going to park this right here. Can I not get off it? All right, we're gonna park it right here. There we go. Wouldn't let me get, oh, and we're right in the cow barn. Hello, cows. Okay, so that one, well. 
No surprises there, really. Yeah, we're 41% manured. Can we do manure and fertilizer? Do we need both manure and fertilizer? Like, if I can cultivate it, that's probably a good thing. But do we need to have it plowed and cultivated? Both? Hmm. I don't really want to plow it. The plowing in this game seems to be such a pain that I really don't feel like doing that right now. Because A, the implement's really small, and B, it just makes everything so ragged. So let's see if this will work. If this will work, we're just going to cultivate. Cultivating soil has not been plowed. You will grow less crops here. You know, I would have just done it, but it had to tell me. Which I'm surprised it did tell me. So, let me drop this. We'll find our plow. Where is our plow? Gotta be over around the other side of this building. Plot. Yeah, there it is. Out in the middle of the yard. Right where it belongs. Hmm. I still don't know. I know we will grow less crops there. No, I don't care. We're doing it anyway. I really don't feel like plowing today. Because that's going to take forever. Ooh. Get in there. There we go. Whereas the cultivating doesn't take, seem like it takes nearly as long. So. Yes, I know. Okay, but it will let us cultivate anyway. So I'm going to go ahead and cultivate... Uh, this field. We're just going to do this field today because I don't know if it's even going to let me plant it because of what month we're in. So I'm going to go ahead and cultivate this and then I'll get back with you and we'll go get that cedar. See you soon.
Well, evidently, if I had waited until I cultivated, I could have seen where we were spreading the manure. So I'm wondering if after we seed, if we'll still be able to spread manure and or fertilizer. It'll be interesting. We're just... This first year is just an experiment, basically. We're just testing things out to see how things work. So I think in that other field, when we go to plant that one, um, when I go to work that one up, I will plow that one first. If for nothing else, then just so it stops yelling at me the entire time I'm trying to do something. All right, let's get off that tractor. So we are 100% cultivated, 41% covered in manure. Let's see, how much manure do we have now? 240 kilos, so not much. But let's stick it in here and spread it anyway, because why not? It'll work for like a second. All I did before was I pulled this under and there wasn't even a trigger, it just kinda, yeah, it came out, made a mess. <laughs> So, if we start this over here, we should be able to see where it's gone. Yeah, see, that spread more than I thought it would. Container's empty. Okay. But we can kind of see that we've covered it and we got an extra 4%, 45% manure now. So that's good to know. It should only take a couple of weeks to have enough manure to cover both the fields, I think. So we'll just go ahead and park this. We can get it back over here. There we go. We'll park right there. Beautiful. All right, what are we doing? So I've got to go get that fertilizer still, is way up here. At some point I'm gonna drive up there and get that, but I think we're gonna take the other tractor down here, grab that cedar. I think we have seeds, don't we? Yes, we have 740 kilos of wheat seeds, which I don't know if that's a lot. Ooh, we also have some fertilizer in stock, Fert X. Need formalizer, access fertilizer, and manure combined. Oh, interesting. That's probably going to be more expensive. Um, I wish it was easier to move multiple things because I would take like a load of uh, canola and then go get that and then bring both implements back. But I can only do one thing at a time. So let me drive down there. Where are we going from here? We're going, if we go out the south road, we're just basically heading south until we hit Sam. All right, I'll do that. I'll meet you over there at Sam's place. see a greenhouse that needs to be rebuilt an unfinished roof oh he's got a little garden here let's go ahead and park and see if we can't find Sam Sam's over there he's neutral Sam. yo man what's up you tell me you don't look so good had a rough night Really rough, man. God, my head. Is that cedar over there yours? Sure is. Why ask? I just moved in, and I could use a cedar, even as old as this one. Hmm, let me think. Perhaps if you help me, I can help you. I was hired to plow a field nearby, but I can barely move my legs today. What if you plow it for me? Sure. 
and then fix these two greenhouses for me. My ma will be so happy. Then I give you the cedar for free. What you think? Man, I was really hoping to not have to plow today. Sure, you got a deal. All right, good luck. See you around. Okay. So... The field is all the way down here. All right, I'll go get the plow. Go look at that new vehicle store. Maybe we could buy a plow. You got a plow over there? Where is that? That's this way. Do 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 do. Aha, we'll just jump your gate. See what they have over here. And then we've got a plow that. Oh, that's a massive field. Not cool, bro. That and fixed greenhouses. This better be a nice cedar. Ooh, they got a big harvester. Nice trailer. Too bad we can't, like, lease things. Leasing wouldn't be bad. Because we have 5,555 euros right now, which is not a lot. Oh, they got all sorts of stuff. What is this, like... Potato harvester, quarter million, oh, beet harvester, quarter million dollars, oh, 79,000. Cheaper than I thought. Ooh, they got a little trailer. That's only, we could actually buy that, it's so small. Custom CX type tractor, 105,000. Right, that's more than a harvester. A nice cultivator. I don't think we could pull that with our tractor, though. Nice trailers. Ooh, here's a nice tractor. 60,000. 7,000 for that cultivator. We might actually look to upgrade. And how much is... Oh, it's a beet seeder. 44,000. Anyway, all right. I guess I will run up there and get the plow bring it back down here and then plow this gigantic field <laughs> it's not really that bad i'm more just messing with myself about it but yes i'll go grab the plow come back here and then i will get this plowed i wish i could do the greenhouses first just to knock them out and then work on plowing actually you know what when we get back to the um the farm i have milk and eggs i need to collect and we got to check on our greenhouse so let me head back up that way and uh i'll see you when we get up there so we can do the things shop and we have a couple dollars in our pocket so you know what that means we have to buy new things uh i want to get some more seedlings ah the doors flung me i want to get some more seedlings do, 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 do. greenhouse goods we have zucchini tomato pumpkin melon bell pepper i don't think we have either of these we can get so many okay uh, if we buy like 10, let's go 20. We'll fill the greenhouse 20, 20. And I think we had five, so let's can I get another five of each of these. Five and five. What did we have a bunch of? I think we have a bunch of zucchini, so we'll get five of everything else.
And then that should be plenty to fill up the rest of our greenhouse. Because we're already paying to keep it wet in there. You know, so might as well grow everything we can grow. We can grow grass, so I wonder if we can actually make hay. There's tetters and all that. I don't remember if we saw any or not. We own 15 hens. What's the max? Yeah. We're trying to see if those eggs will hatch, so we're not going to buy any more hens. We have... We're half full on hen food. Cows. Let's buy a couple cows. We buy... We could buy six more cows. Let's go... Just, we'll double what we have. We'll buy two more cows. We don't have any ducks. I don't know what ducks do, but let's buy a couple ducks. Buy two ducks. Ooh, and geese. We'll buy two geese. We already own the rooster. Pigeons. We don't own any pigeons, so let's buy two of those. I told you, we're, we're just going to spend all this money. Uh, fertilizer... We have a little bit. I don't know how far that'll go. So let's wait. I'm not going to buy any. How much is manure? Mm, how much did we put in there before? It's not a lot. Yeah, we'll just, we're making fertilizer. We'll just wait. We already own the cat. We don't need any of that other stuff. Or we'll just, we're making manure, not fertilizer. And we'll see how long that goes. So let's buy these guys. That's another $1,000. And then, what do we got? Seeds. I don't know how far our seeds will go. Maybe we will just wait. But we can grow wheat, corn, barley, canola, peas, soy, lupine. I'm not even sure what that is. Grass, potatoes, and beets. But we're not going to get any of that because we already have wheat seeds. And I want to grow wheat so that we can get straw so that we can feed our cows. All right. Now I'll meet you back up at the farm. that there for now let's check on our greenhouse let's door behind us uh let's get all the plants in here before we do anything these are peppers right let's say it doesn't say these are peppers so let's grab our bell peppers plop these down here One, two, three, four, five, six. Hmm. I want to start organizing these a little better. So we're going to do one, like one full table of a thing. Let's do chilies over here. Keep our peppers together. That one's going to be chilies. And then... We got pukes. Pukes can go in the corner. That one was seven. Two, four, six, seven. Is this also two, four, six, seven? Okay, so it's seven a piece. What do we have here? We've got those are tomatoes. These are melons, right? I believe these are melons. Or not tomatoes, pumpkins. So we'll put another melon there. We'll grab a pumpkin. We'll fill this one up with pumpkin. Okay. Those are all zucchini. I don't know what those are. So I guess we'll just continue mixed. But once we get rid of these, I want to do it like a one table is one thing. Uh, 
tomatoes. We'll put tomatoes in the corner. One, two, three, four. Let's see what else we got to fill up with first. Tomatoes. Keep going melons over here. One, two, three, four. Yeah, this is gonna be ugly. I'm sorry. It is a big thing. We got cucumbers. The last of our bell peppers down. One, two, three. We'll finish that out with cucumbers. Actually, we'll finish that out with peppers. Let's do... What did we have one more of? Tomatoes? This one tomato is going to be lonely all by himself. And then we'll put cucumbers there. Boop, boop. And then we put chilies down here. Boop, 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 boop. All right, that's it. That's all of our spots filled. Can we buy a second greenhouse? Anyway, get our comfort up. Mole comfort right up to the very tippy top. Uh, maybe a little bit more. There you go. Perfect. Perfect comfort for our, our little veggie friends in our very nice greenhouse. Okay, so that part's done. Now, let's go milk our cows and see our two new cows. Where's our ducks and gooses? Are they down here on the pond? Do they just wander? We don't have like hutches for them or anything. We have two ducks and two geese, and they are just somewhere. All right, cows it is. Let's see who needs to be milked. Probably not you two. You're our new cows. Hello, new cows. Look, we got twins. All right, let's milk who needs milking. We got what, Sarah and Stephanie, and then Jasmine and Jezebel. Cow stuck its butt in our face. What is up with that cow? Okay. So, now our cows are doing good. We do have a little bit more straw. We have like three bales over where the harvester is that we can add in there. Hey, kitty. Ooh. Pigeons, right? This is a. Oh, there they are. There's our pigeons. Hello, pigeons on the pigeon house. It's really hard to see them. You can kind of see they're on the upper two balconies facing us. We can get a better angle on them. You can kind of see them up there. If I get closer, you can see them. Maybe I can zoom in. There you go. Hope you can see them well. Well, maybe like this so that there's actually a white background behind them. Anyway, pigeons are there. Chickens. We have eggs to collect. They're not in with the chickens, are they? The ducks? I wouldn't think so. No, I don't see any ducks in there. Oh, yeah, maybe. Or are you just a No, you're a white chicken. I thought you were a duck. All right, Eggy Wiggies, leaving that one. And then we'll cook up all our food real quick. See what we can cook. I think it's just, oh, you know what? I wanna go get that egg recipe book from that fella next door. While we're got five bucks in our pocket. Cause I'm so bad at saving. I have five dollars in my pocket. I have something that's worth five dollars that I want to buy. All right, so we'll leave all that there. That is good. So many noises. I don't see the ducks anywhere. I don't see any ducks or geese wandering the farmyard. Why are you? Okay, I missed a spot. Hold on.
There we go. That makes me feel better. We also have that fence needs repairing. Let's repair that real quick. There, that's a little bit better. A little bit better. All right. Let's go get this egg book. I know I'm doing basically anything to not go plow. I think we're not going to do that today. We're going to get this egg book. We're going to make some food. I'm going to do another quick scan for these ducks and geese. And then probably call that you. a day. Hello. Yes, give me your egg book. Here to trade. Here to trade? Sure. What do you need? Egg recipe book. Gourmet recipe book one. Eggs. Buy you. Oh, we got flowers. We can prepare garden soil. There's also a chainsaw. Cuts bushes and smaller trees. Let's buy that as well. Yes. Because there's some ugly tree not ugly trees but there's some like dead trees in our yard and this would be nice so let's do that quick i want to cut them trees down while i'm thinking about it can we also that was the other question can i use this to get rid of like these guys it does not seem so okay but we have like these trees. Aha! Uh -huh. Yes. Just get near them and they go away. All the dead trees. Just be careful near the bushes I want to keep. Do, do, do. Anything that doesn't have leaves or flowers on it's getting gone. Don't get near that tree. Yes, yes. And just this couple little guys over here. The place is shaping up nicely. It's looking real good. Bushes can stay. I think that'll be it. Oh, and I turn around and there's one right there. Okay. Is there any more in here? Let's go look around the front of the house real quick. Do, 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 do. No, I think it looks nice. I think we're good. I gotta figure out how to prepare a garden so we can plant flowers. But let's do a cook. Do I need to read this book or something? Read this book. Yes, okay. You just learned new recipes for unique egg dishes. Cool. Now what can we cook? Egg casserole a la forest. Red egg casserole. An oriental egg casserole. So we need melons and tomatoes. Tomatoes and bell peppers. Or mushrooms and... Not zucchini, but I assume it's a cucumber. Oh no, it is zucchini. Okay, oh, and the mushrooms. I don't think I have them in my pocket. I think it's counting mushrooms from down... Oh, I do have three in my pocket. Never mind. I thought those were ones I had put on the shelf downstairs. So apparently it doesn't count stuff that's on the shelf downstairs. That's okay. Oh, one more thing. Honey-based recipes. I realized that if I'm not using uh, the engineering site and I come over here, it pops up a little place beehive majigger. So let's place a beehive. Bees produce honey and are very beneficial for your nearby garden. They also are completely harmless. Social benefits. Plus 250. Nice. So now we have bees. And there's... So there was a spot... I think over near the fields. And then a spot over near the chickens that that also popped up. I wonder if it's the same with those scarecrows. Let's go look at the scarecrows. Weren't there scarecrows in the middle of the field there? Somewhere. 
Ah, uh, yeah. So if I get over here, is that just like something I buy? Because I thought we were going to have to... Yeah. 150 euro. So I wonder if we... Once we plant everything and it's growing, if we place a scarecrow, and then like when we go to harvest, if we can just pick it back up, or if we gotta buy it every year. Ooh, are they in that barn? Is that ducks? Ducks and gooses? Hey, birdies, I found you. Hello. Aw, you're cute. Are you two mad at each other? You're not talking to each other? Is that why you're standing butt to butt? There, we found our birds. Now, once our stuff in our greenhouse grows, we'll have things to make extra um, recipes. But for now, we'll just make it like these. I actually have a ton of food. Like, we'll go downstairs and I'll show you once we get this, because I'll put a bunch of this on the shelf as well. I have so much food. Down into our canning spot. Enter the pantry. So, let's move some of this over. That and that. And, yeah, actually, we'll move that and that, too. So, we have three strawberries, nine mushrooms, four fish and tomato sauce... 17 apple sauces, 25 condensed milk, 194 eggs, two spicy pumpkins, and a regular milk. Here, we'll take the regular milk. And can I move these? If I get in my inventory, uh, through this button, can I move where these are? Oh, I just ate it. <laughs> I assume I didn't drop it, right? Did I eat it? Yeah, milk plus 15. I just want to move these. Okay, so that recipe book is done. We already read it. We don't need it anymore. So let's put it in the attic. Because that's where I put our perfume and the ring that I found in the other chest. And we can store our egg thing in there. Aha! Looks good. Ooh! gonna fall down go down the stairs thank you close that I close that door we'll leave the kitchen open we can close the baby room and the whatever room this is a little bathroom over here too boop close you boop close you yes all right I think we're gonna call that good. Everything's going pretty keenly. Um, and then next time we'll grab that plow, drive down there, do the plowing and the building and stuff so that we can get the cedar, so we can try to plant this field and see how that works. Also, we need to go collect that fertilizer at some point and then while we have a little bit of money, I want to get the materials to repair this barn to fix it. But that'll be it for today. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you had fun. I did. And I've learned new stuff every time I play this game. Learning new stuff. So have a wonderful day, and I will see you next time. Bye.